All right, welcome back to Houston Life. Thanksgiving is a week from today, which means wow. Tis the season for holiday shopping in those classic movies. Oh yeah, well, yep. A Christmas Story is one of those classics. It follows nine-year-old Ralphie in his pursuit to get the greatest gift of all time, a Red Ryder BB gun. <laughs> well, now there is a brand new sequel featuring Ralphie 40 years later. All right, so did he shoot his eye out as his mother feared? KPRC 2's Sophia Ojeda actually had the chance to uh, sit down with Peter Billingsley, the actor who plays that beloved Ralphie. And apparently, Sophia is a huge fangirl. <laughs> I have been excited about this for days now, knowing that I was going to get to meet Ralphie from A Christmas Story. So excited. Guys, Peter Billingsley is joining us now to let us know about his new movie. First of all, thank you so much, Peter. Thank for you for having us. me. This is fun. Oh, I'm so excited. All right, this new film is A Christmas Story Christmas. That's right. So tell us about it. Well, it's been 39 years since we shot wow. the original movie. So I think it was a little now or never in terms of doing a sequel, but we got to have the entire kid cast return. So it was really fun to imagine where are they now. Ralphie's a dad, he's got his own family, it takes place in 1973, and uh, it's really sort of starts with the passing of the old man, and Ralphie goes home to give his kids a Christmas like he had growing up. And now it's on him to make it That's a great right. Christmas. It's this task that all parents yes. <laughs> work so hard to do. It's true, and that's kind of the replacement. As a kid, you want, right, you're obsessed with gifts. In Ralphie's case, he wanted a BB gun, but as a parent, what you want is Christmas to be perfect for your kids. Yeah. And so they, it's the pressures, it's what we were talking about before, the messiness, but then also that hope and optimism that Christmas morning will deliver something great, and it often does. And so I know that, you know, blast from the past, you had friends come now to work on this new one, and we love to see old friends, right? You love to just, just get together, <clears throat> yeah. and you're coming home, you're seeing Flick and Schwartz That's are back. Right. Tell us about how fun was that to be able to work together? It was great, because we've all kept in touch over the years. We had a really good experience on the first one, but we've never all really been together um, in a really, really long time. So we also built 11 houses on the old Cleveland Street, including the Parker House, the Bumpus House, and I remember we finished construction, the last one, and I looked around and thought, oh my gosh, we're back, and I called the guys, they were in the hotel, and I said, you gotta get down here and check this out. <laughs> and we blew snow on the trees, and it just felt like, I think it was kind of emotional for them too, because I've been working on this movie for four years, okay. developing this, and they thought, oh my gosh, we're back. So tell us about that side of it. How was it emotionally to, <clears throat> to be able to go back and kind of relive the memories that we all love, right? I mean, this movie, Christmas Story, is on repeat at my house. It's amazing. Every holiday. Yeah, yeah and it wasn't, you know, it was kind of successful when it came out, but it didn't do great. There was no video or cable. So it's built this life over time. So it's been kind of fun to watch it grow. It's almost like a kid, you're sort of watching it grow up. <laughs> and yeah, and then the popularity that's gained from it. So I think it was, in some ways, it wasn't overnight success for everybody. It was something that's, that's built, and it's been really it's been really nice to see because the movie has a very personal connection to a lot of families and I think the one takeaway I always get is everyone feels like that Parker family is their family. There are so many great scenes in in the movie but uh, some of them are, not this new movie Christmas Story but you remember the triple dog dare. For sure. Now are we going to be able to see some of those similar? Well I can tell you this um, Flick and Schwartz are back. They never left the small town. And so you can imagine as kids and friends, that same dynamic goes into adulthood. There's those things that cement when you're young that just do not change. I love it. All right, another big question is why now? You know, it's been so long. What, what inspired you to do this now? Well, I think we really wanted to get it right. You know, we had a lot of the resources. I said we were able to build all those houses. We had the budget to be able to do that. The returning kid cast. Um, and felt like it really was sort of now, and um, we had Legendary and Warner Brothers behind us, so we were able to really recreate the world and the universe, and that was important to us that fans feel like they're sort of effortlessly back in there. And we want to give you guys a little sneak peek here. We're going to show you this clip from the movie. Take a look. Keep it up, guys. How come you're not helping? Well, we're having fun watching you. Yeah. When it's just us, it kind of feels like child labor. <laughs> oh, no, honey, it's not labor if we don't pay you. Yeah. Oh, I'm scared. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> with a with a little cheers at the end. It's not, yeah, it's not we, child labor. It's not child labor. You see, we're trying to capture the tone of the original. It's yes. not the most polite family in the world, but there's a lot of love at the core. Exactly. We want to do something fun really quick. <laughs> sure. It would be a good sport. We think you might have a relative here at KPRC. It's our chief meteorologist, Frank Billingsley. Oh, wow. We did a little side-by-side. -side. Look at that. Frank Billingsley. Looks like Peter he's definitely Billingsley in the family. The little blue. Frank, the it's blue wonderful eyes. to be connected again. <laughs> I love it. You're so, so long. much fun. Hey, we're running out of time, but tell folks when they can check this out. Uh, the movie is streaming on HBO Max now. Yes. So it just came out, and we're really, really excited to share it. So excited. Peter, thank you so much. This thank you for having an me. an honor. Appreciate oh it. Oh, my gosh. All right. A Christmas Story Christmas. Check it out. Streaming exclusively on HBO Max. I triple dog dare you. Nicely done. <laughs> I triple dog dare you. Hey, that's side by side, by the way, with Frank and Peter. Unmistakably, they have to be related. Yeah, they, I mean, that was, per we got to show Frank that. It's good stuff. I mean, that'd blow him away. Thanks, Sophia. Great interview.